How's it going everyone? So today's video, I'm sure you guys can probably already tell by the title, we wanna talk about the new Tesla truck. So there's not a whole lot of information out just yet, but some information has been leaked um, or kind of just hidden a little bit. Um, and I'm gonna get into that in today's video, but I wanna kind of start the discussion and let you guys know um, just some of the stuff that I've found out so far on that truck. Um, one claim is that um, it's going to be, have a 300,000 pounds towing capacity. Yes, I said 300,000. So most of the trucks, I'm sure you guys are aware of, like 1,500 uh, trucks, they're around like you know 12,000 pounds payload that they're able to tow. Well, uh, Elon Musk is claiming that his truck can tow 300,000 pounds. And um, just for reference, some of his other vehicles, um, the cars and the SUV, he's demonstrated them pulling like insane amounts like a jetliner and stuff and like 250,000 pounds he's showed that these things can pull so um not that anybody would ever pull that but i guess that he's just demonstrating the torquiness or potential of the electric motors um so i'm going to show you guys a few uh renderings that have been released and there's also one specific photo that is a sneak preview from tesla itself and um, we're gonna get into that and talk a little bit more about some of these renderings and uh, where things might go. So a quick Google search will lead you here and you'll see some of the renderings and I just wanna point this out before I kinda of go full resolution on you guys. There's a few renderings. So this one is a rendering as well as some of these other ones. Um, and this here is actually a sneak preview from Tesla. So let's go ahead and talk about this one first. So this picture here you can see um, or barely see, this is supposed to be the back sort of tailgate portion and it's uh, essentially a wraparound taillight uh, type thing. A lot of people are relating this top portion to like a bed cover, um, but this is supposed to be the rear section of the vehicle. So not a whole lot to show for on this, but um, that's all we're given so far, you guys. So I guess they wanna do some sort of wraparound taillight of some sort like that. And I'm assuming that would just be the bed. The next picture we'll talk about is a rendering. Uh, and a lot of people are say, saying that it takes cues from the RAM styling. Uh, the front end looks very RAM, <laughs> RAM-like, especially the hood too. The way that the hood kind of looks like a, a RAM hood with half the grill chopped off. And even the fenders um, take a lot of styling cues from the RAM itself. Um, there's a couple others. This one here kind of looks like a almost like a Honda Ridgeline type crossover type vehicle. Um, I'm not sure how much, you know, I think people are just kind of taking a crack at it. The one that kind of looks the most similar uh, to a Tesla vehicle or the most resemblance is this one here. Again, I do think it takes a lot of styling cues from the Ram pickup truck, but it does definitely look like a Tesla in the front more than, more than the other ones. All right, so what do you guys think of this whole idea of Tesla trying to get into the pickup truck range? There's also a few tweets, which I can maybe post above here, uh, where he says it's gonna have four to 500 mile range. I guess maybe because it's a bigger vehicle, they're able to do so. Um, they also said it's gonna seat six people, which isn't really, I saw some, some commentary that was making it seem like six people was a big number to fit in a truck, but you guys know if you're into trucks that six seating or six seats in a truck is not anything new. Uh, how, how many trucks have had that bench seat in the middle where you can sit in the middle? So that's nothing new, but uh, four to 500 mile range um, is, is definitely gonna be a decent, decent amount for a truck, I think at least, but I'm interested to see what you guys think. Would you buy something like this? Um, and also some of those styling cues show um, a, you know, storage in the front, kind of like a bed the opposite way, like the same tailgate that flips out on the back, um, that flips out in the front. What do you guys think of that? Do you think that's something that, uh, that would be usable? Do you think it's realistic? Do you think that rendering has any value? I want to know in the comments below since we've been doing so much Ram truck stuff on this channel. And um, let me know what you guys think and we'll see you on the next video. Take care.